पेपर फोर्थ बी अंडरस्टैंडिंग डिसिप्लिन एंड सब्जेक्ट्स टॉपिक रोल ऑफ स्टेट एंड नेशनल एजेंसीज इन शेपिंग सिलेबस एंड टेक्स्ट बुक्स वेलकम टू ऑल ऑन माय यूट्यूब चैनल डिजिटल के एन एल कोचिंग इंट्रोडक्शन कोर्स मटेरियल सच एज द सिलेबस एंड टेक्स्ट बुक सेट द टोन ऑफ ए कोर्स एन इफेक्टिव एंड वेल सेफ सिलेबस कैन इंक्रीज द नंबर ऑफ सक्सेसफुल स्टूडेंट्स स्टूडेंट्स लर्निंग कोरिलेट्स मोर विद द टेक्स्ट बुक्स दैन द टीचर्स देर फॉर चूजिंग ए टेक्स्ट बुक इज एन इम्पोर्टेंट आस्पेक्ट ऑफ टीचिंग ए कोर्स ए गुड टेक्सट बुक ऑलवेज स्पोर्ट्स द कोर्स ऑब्जेक्टिव सिलेबस एंड टेक्सट बुक्स आर वेरी इम्पोर्टेंट पार्ट्स ऑफ एजुकेशनल सिस्टम दे फॉर केयरफुल प्लानिंग मस्ट गो इन टू शेपिंग एंड डेवलपिंग ए सिलेबस रोल ऑफ स्टेट गवर्नमेंट इन सिलेबस शेपिंग सिलेबस इज ए पार्ट ऑफ करिकुलम एंड is a summary of topics which will be covered during an academic course or a text or lecture and every state plays the following roles in the construction of syllabus and curriculum policy making construction of bodies appointment of members for these bodies providing guidelines for curriculum framework monitoring the enacted curriculum ensuring resources for enactment assessment of existing syllabus and curriculum normally the state does not directly concert construct curriculum but put forth the policies for different sections and levels of education the levels are national level state level university level or board level for example in india the state government of india has created following bodies for this purpose ncert at national level scert at state level university syndicate senate board of studies cbsc and state education boards state function the curricular curricular aims major focused areas duration of different courses syllabus for different courses has to be allotted per day or per week special mention on selection of contents revision of the syllabus after getting feedback ncert role of ncert ncert national council of educational research and training is the national apex research institution which was set up in 1961 as an autonomous body under the government of india its mandate is to assist and advise the government of india in the formulation and implementation of policies and programs in the field of school education the decisions regarding curriculum design are essentially done by this professional body ncert at the national level ncert came out with a broad national curriculum framework for the first time 1975 National curriculum for 10 year school a framework 1975 was first attempt of its kind second curriculum framework was brought out in 1988 it was national curriculum for elementary and secondary education the third curriculum framework was brought out in the year 2000 and the fourth national curriculum framework for secondary school was brought in the year 2005 here curriculum refers to the set of subjects or courses offered in school system curriculum can be considered in terms of subject matter or content also functions of ncert improve the quality of school education prepare a big stock of objective based model questions design programs for updating knowledge and skills ncert textbooks attractive and inexpensive promote a healthy 
reading habit and CRT textbooks have authentic information written in easy language clear and strong basics at the end of every chapter there are many questions free answers on www.topperlearning.com the cost of ncrt books very low role of scrt it provides academics directions to the regional officers district education officers block education officers and principals of schools its functions are as under in service training extension activity training research and publication role of ncte coordinating and monitoring teacher education undertaking survey and studies relating to various aspects of teacher making recommendations to the center and state government universities ugc developing a guideline for journal teacher education program preparing guideline with regard to minimum qualification for teacher educator preparing a guideline for starting new courses recently ncte has made B.Ed. course of two years duration and provided new curriculum syllabus and teacher training system for it. So students, this is the important question for you. Thank you for watching.